Good morning. It is April 7th and a Thursday. And the reason why I'm laughing is because the devil is a liar. This will be my fourth time doing this because some of the words I just couldn't spit them out like evangelism. Say that fast 20 times and see what happens. Okay. Today's Walk with God book, Deep in Your Shine. Those who are wise will shine like the brightness of the heavens and those who lead many to righteousness like the stars forever and ever. That's Daniel chapter 12, verse three. People spend thousands of dollars to last longer. Exercise, cosmetics, plastic surgery, self-help advice, nutritional plans. In other words, the entire self-preservation industry is a huge business. We like life when we want it to last, not just in some ethereal, nondescript expectations of a life hereafter, but in a real fulfilling, purposeful eternity. We don't just want forever, we want to know we will enjoy it. Daniel is told what makes or breaks eternity in the resurrection, righteousness. Loving it, drinking it in, leading others to it, and investing in it. Righteousness is the key. The quality of our righteousness on earth has everything to do with the quality of our eternity. And those who are wise know it. Those who are wise also know that there's a problem. We are inherently unrighteous and eternity based on earthly righteousness is a devastating predicament for people who are in their very genetics infected with corruption. Are there any who can really lead others to righteousness? Will any shine like the brightness of the heavens? Or is the promise empty? We who know Jesus know the answer, of course. Righteousness is a gift from a holy heaven to an infected race. It comes from outside of ourselves, available only through faith in its giver. Those who are wise will tell others about this gift. Those who want to shine will know the source of the light and will be completely preoccupied with him. You know, you probably know of the Bible's imperatives about evangelism. We are commanded to spread the gospel of salvation throughout the world. Have you known also of this promise in Daniel? Evangelism is one way to make an investment that never ever ceases to bring abundant returns. God promises that sharing the light with others will forever deepen your own shine. And it's the truth. And I've always said the Great Commission was not an option to be considered, but a command to be obeyed. That's Matthew 28 verses 18 through 20. Thomas Watson once said, eternity to the godly is a day that has no sunset. God bless you and have a wonderful Thursday.